name is Betty Boop. Boop Boop Badoop. Work's been kinda slow since cartoons went to color. I still got it, Eddie. Yup a dup a dup a dup. Boop boop be doop boop. Ooh, that looks good on you. Boop be doop be doop be doop. Boop boop ba doop. Hello everyone, I'm Nika Chung. Welcome back to my channel. Hope everyone is having a great day. I am back with a brand new vintage cartoon reaction and this was suggested by one of my subscribers. Thank you so much for your request. Baby Boop is one of my favorite characters. She's iconic. She can sing, dance, and brings a smile to you when you hear her voice. I enjoyed the episodes on VHS when I was a kid and I always sang along. She was created by Max Fletcher and Grim Natwick. Baby Boop made her first appearance in the cartoon Dizzy Dishes released on August 9th of 1930, the seventh installment in the Fletcher's Talk Tune series. The character was originally created as an anthropomorphic French poodle. And Bimbo is also Bay's main love interest. They have a very interesting relationship. <laughs> Fletcher's inspiration of Bay Boop came from the actress Clara Bow, one of the caricature of the singer Helen Kane. But there is one singer and entertainer that definitely was inspiration, Baby Esther Jones, entertainer of the late 1920s, known for interpreting a popular song with a mixture of a seriousness and a childish mischief. The hair and outfit is spot on, as you can see in the photos. The studios defend themselves by arguing that Kane's style of singing characterized by her baby voice and the use of the phrase boop boop ba doop was not her own invention. Theatrical manager Low Bolton testified during the Kane vs. Fletcher trial that Kane saw Baby Esther's cabaret act in 1928 in which Esther used the interplotted words such as boo boop and doo doo. However, Helen Kane and Baby Esther Jones are both talented in their own ways. They brought something really cool to the iconic character. Unfortunately, there is no video clips of Esther Jones I wish there was. <laughs> The episode I'm reacting to is Snow White. It debuted in 1933 and starring Mae Questel as Bay Boop and featuring Cap Calloway as Coco the Clown. I haven't seen this, but I'm definitely excited to check it out. So y'all, let's jump right into Bay Boop in Snow White. Roll clip, roll it, roll it. <laughs> I couldn't help the music was good. I'm just moving with the flow. <laughs> I love the song Cap Cowboy's music, it's so smooth. Made a I remember this introduction. When you wear the wing, ain't she cute? Boop boop be doo. <laughs> Buffing her nose? <laughs> Magic mirror in my hand, who's the fairest in the land? You're the fairest in the land, you're the fairest in the land. <laughs> <laughs> I've heard 
Wow, her face looks like eggs in a pan. <laughs> that was hilarious. Magic mirror in my hand. Who's the fairest in the land? You're the fairest in the land. You're the fairest in the land. <laughs> oh, she jealous. Off with her head. <laughs> Oh, my God. 
This one's cute. I enjoyed this. The golden age of cartoon animation was lit from 1930s until the 1970s. Cartoonists drew every character by hand. That is true talent right there. One thing I did notice in this anime short was how precise they had Coco the Clown dancing exactly like Cat Calvin. He was a clown, but then the witch turned him into a uh, ghost. He still got that same precise movement just like Cap to the T. I'm truly impressed about that. Like, <laughs> it was really cool. I'm familiar with the original story of Snow White, but this animation was so creative. It was hilarious. The queen was so jealous of Betty. She did things to try to get rid of her. And one of the funniest scenes was when her face actually turned into eggs in a frying pan. That was hilarious. <laughs> and I'm glad that Coco and Bimbo keep her aid and rescued her. And I'm glad they actually discarded everything and just buried it. <laughs> that was cool. I enjoyed all the songs, especially the James Infirmary performed by Cab Calloway. What did you guys think of Bay Boop in Snow White? And which anime short should I react to next from Bay Boop? Let me know in the comments below. I'm your host, Anika Chung, and I'll see you next time on my next music and film review. Love yourself always, and remember, be excellent to each other. All right, guys, see you in the next picture. Boop, boop, we do. Oh! Don't speak that kind of me. I've asked you very confidently.